A fifth group of agents are called alpha-glucosidase inhibitors. The, in Canada, it's available as glucobay or acarbose. This is a pill that's taken with meals, and it acts to slow the breakdown of starch or carbohydrates in the gut, allowing for a slower rise in your blood sugar as the digestion of those starches is slowed. This also allows the amount of insulin that you currently can secrete to be effective enough to hold your blood sugar down as it delays the absorption of the glucose from the intestines. Glucobay is taken as a 50 milligram or 100 milligram tablet and it must be titrated. That is, you must start at a low dose and test it, taking it less frequently and slowly increase it over several weeks to its full dose. The reason for that is that this drug can cause a considerable amount of abdominal gas, bloating, uh, and uh, some cramping of the gut. And therefore, if taken in low dose with meals and starting at, for example, a half or one tablet in the morning, once a day, and then increasing it after one week to twice a day or three times a day and slowly working up to 50 milligrams three times a day or even 100 milligrams three times a day. And it can be then very effective in reducing your blood sugar. However, it is not as overall powerful in reducing blood sugars as are the sulfonylureas or metformin. However, it works very effectively and certainly as an add-on agent in treating, low, uh, treating blood sugars.